made Garcia so so tough in the second game? Well, working that good cutter slider combo. You know, he also has a good fastball that'll sneak in there every now and then. Um, you know, he didn't leave too many pitches over the heart of the plate. You know, he just went out there and did his thing, and uh, just really couldn't really couldn't scratch a rally against him. I still have the best record in baseball, but is it disappointing? Just two games and a lot left to play, but to to come out after the break like this. Well, it's not how you want to start, but uh, like you said, it's just two games, and you know, now those games are over with, and we got a big series coming up in Baltimore against a hot team. So, you know, learn from today, you know, rest up tonight, and you know, get after it tomorrow. What do you learn from your meetings with the Astros during the regular season here? Are you talking about these past two games, or just in general? In general, the seven you played against the Astros. Do you take anything away from that that could potentially help you should you meet in October? Oh, definitely. You take a lot. Uh, I'm not going to give you all the secrets, but. Uh, you know, they're a good ball club over there. You know, good ball club with a great pitching staff. Their offense, you know, you can't you can't give them, you know, extra outs or even, you know, make outs on the base path and, you know, help them out a little bit. You know, I, I think back to, you know, getting doubled, doubled off on Carpenter's ball that he hit right at me. You know, it's, you know, a tough break. And then you, you know, kind of let them get out of a jam in that first game. But, um, no, they're a great ball club, and we'll definitely see them down the road. You've been in this ballpark for some tough losses, maybe this same locker even. Uh, uh, do you feel that they're kind of the giant that you guys need to slay? You guys have pretty much steamed row everyone this year. They won the season series 5-2. I know that that doesn't matter come October, but does it, does it get in your head at all that that's a team that knocked you guys out of the playoffs a couple times, and here you guys are the best record in baseball and, and still have had trouble with them? I'm kind of focused on one, the last thing you said, that we got the best record in baseball. And, um, you know, like I said, they're a great, they're a great team. And, I'm not going to sit here and, and dwell on things that happened in the past, you know, no matter what, good or bad. So, um, you know, we'll, we'll see what comes, ha what happens down the stretch. But I'm, I'm focused on, on this year. And, you know, this team's, we got a good ball club here. We just got to keep, you know, stay within ourselves and focus on ourselves. And I think good things will happen. How important is that best record in the American League and the home field advantage in the playoffs that would go with that to you? No, that's, that's big time. You know, that's something we're striving for, you know, especially how, you know, how well we've been playing at home, you know, how rowdy our fans are, how much they support us. Um, you know, it's something that, you know, is definitely on our mind. And, you know, but, but like I said, if we just focus on what we need to do and, you know, control what this team does, um, you know, we'll take care of that part.